Hello and welcome to 101 Ideas for Minecraft Learners. My name is Professor Adam and in this episode I'm going to be showing you how to download and install a resource pack. Now resource packs uh, can change the look, feel and sounds of Minecraft would you believe. They are amazingly powerful tools and uh, I've had some people asking me how do I do it you know because they've been uh, sent all over the internet uh, and the, you know there's uh, have they downloaded the right thing, which folder it goes in etc etc. So what I want to do is I want to make a kind of definitive video showing you how to do it and look at these lovely chickens at my feet. So this is what Minecraft looks like default the vanilla look of minecraft the kind of the you know that uh, it's very blocky it's very lovely it's uh, it's flat uh, in many ways resource packs can add 3d things a higher resolutions and all sorts of lovely things even animated textures too so where do we find this stuff well there are actually lots and lots of different places to look for it but the place i'm going to be looking for today is a place that i use quite regularly and it's called planet Minecraft and I'm not associated with them. I'm not kind of you know advertising or anything. I just use it Okay, it's just it's just basics kind of good um, And uh, I'll talk a bit about it as we go in. So let's go and have a look at um, Planet Minecraft So this is what planet Minecraft looks like uh, we've got planetminecraft.com at the top We've got some skins, we've got some projects, we've got some textures, you can scroll down and do, do all that kind of stuff. I've got, I'm signed up, I'm the common people, you can come and find me and my projects on Planet Minecraft too. So Planet Minecraft is a, a kind of a, a membership, you know, you join and uh, there are lots of people who've, uh, who produce content uh, for Minecraft. Now, there's uh, projects, you can do skins, textures some servers even and even some mods and blogs would you believe so people actually talk about minecraft for themselves so let's have a look up here so we can browse all these things down here even banners would you believe there's community stuff so there's some memberships there's forums there's some chat some projects projects are often builds skins obviously you want to look at all different kinds of skins but what we're looking for in this particular uh, episode is texture packs so i'm going to click here and uh, here we go. So we can kind of scroll down. We can kind of see there's some tabs straight away. There's almost some advertising. We're just going to ignore that. Recently updated um, uh, tab. So we've got kind of uh, all sorts of different updated tab. That looks quite nice. Serenity 1.8. Fuse craft even. There's a gun pack, which I believe. Uh, there's uh, Norse Winds. Simply HD plastic. Let's go to the most popular and see what the most popular uh, pack is at the moment. Wow, that's photorealistic. I'm not going to quite go for that. There's, there's Sfax Pure BD Craft, which is pretty cool, awesome, isn't it? Uh, OCD, uh, which is a lovely pack as well. That's 1.8, nearly completed. Um, well, I want something that's kind of a little bit 3D, a little bit 3D. Oh, there's a modern one. Should I have a modern one? 1.8.1. Well, that's quite good. Let's go for modern. Oh, well, it's not quite complete yet. You can see how far people have done things with this. So let's have a look. There's Adventure Time, which looks fantastic. Uh, there's that one. There's some realistic ones. Uh, there's Jolly Craft, which is absolutely lovely. Um, and it's for 1.8. Oh, there's Roman Craft. Now, this is if you want to make turn yourself into Rome, which is brilliant fun. And even it's got even soundtracks underneath it, too. Uh, so let's go down here. There's uh, there's one point. Uh, there's modern HD. Um, let's see if they've got any 3D stuff. Like realism. Um, let's let's narrow our search. So I wonder if we can kind of do this. So we want uh, we want 64 resolution. I think that'd be really good. Any game version? Well, we want it to be 1.8.1 1 .1 at least. So we'll put that in there. Okay, that's great. So that's narrowed our search down a bit. And look, we've got this thing. Oh my goodness. Um, should we have Iron Man? Oh, it's only 60% complete. Um, um, I want something that's 100%. There's a Christmas Carol, which looks quite good. There's KubeCon. Um, let's go for this one. Elements 64. It looks quite cool. Um, I've never seen it before. Don't really know anything about it. Let's click on that. See what it says. So we've got. If we click on it, we can see some pictures of it. 
and it looks quite amazing, doesn't it? It looks amazing. We've got uh, you can change. It obviously changes the way your uh, your menu looks like as well. Um, things are pretty sweet there. Okay, so more pictures of it. We can kind of see a little bit more uh, information. So it's sort of it's kind of kind of spooky. Look at all the fruit and vegetables that there are. Foodstuffs, combat, and there are there's some villager skins as well, which they look quite amusing too. Okay, cool. Once you've decided what your pack is, we can go and download it. So let's, if we click here, we go to download it. Now that's straight away just downloaded it like that. Now sometimes it's going to take you to a, a media file site, and let's see if I can find one of those uh, because I want to just um, make sure that you, you know, if you are downloading this stuff, um, let's do the modern, the modern HD pack. See if that's going to take me to. Um, that's direct download. Is it going to take me to uh here we go this is what I was after so it's going to take me to an ad fly and that's because the people who make these packs are trying to monetize uh, their content okay they're trying to sell it in some way or another and trying to make money and why not they can do they're allowed to and what you get is you get an ad fly site like this an ad fly is a kind of a place where you can host uh, certain files uh, and planet minecraft allows certain places to do this okay so it is a safe thing to do, but what you've got to do is ignore all this down the bottom. Look at the ad fly thing at the top. Go right across the top, and in the right-hand corner, there's something that says skip ad. And that's what I want you to press. Okay. So always look around for kind of, uh, you know, if you, you are going there. Media file is going to be safe. Ad fly to media file. That's where it's going to act, uh, send up. And there we go, we've got this thing up here. And again, loads of advertising all around, which we've got to ignore. Even this stuff over here, we're going to ignore. We're going to look at this big green button up here and press download there. And we start to download that down the bottom there. So that's great. So we're, we've now got two zip files downloading. So we're going to nip back. I'm going to let them download. I'm going to nip back, go into Minecraft, and I'm going to show you how to install them into Minecraft. So we've got those two textures. Okay, so here I am back into Minecraft, and uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to press escape, boo, like that. I'm going to go to options, I'm going to click on options, and then go down to resource packs, and you've probably seen it down here, so I'm going to click on there. And as you see, actually I've got some resource packs already. Uh, these are available resource packs on the left hand side, this left window. And on the right hand side, that's kind of what the resource pack that I've got running at the moment. It's the default look of Minecraft, okay? So how do we get the things that we've just downloaded over here? Well, I go down here, it says open resource pack folder, click on that, and a window has appeared. Now this will happen if even if you're in Linux, if you're in Windows, uh, it will open up a window, which is great. So I'm gonna put my window there, uh, and I've already got my downloads window open up here, which is over here. So we can see there's my resource packs I've actually got inside the window that I've actually, you know, I've, that are available to me. And if we look down here, we can see uh, users, Adam, library, application support. This is where it is on a Mac. On a PC, it's in a different location, but that, that's kind of what you're gonna see. And then I'm gonna put, select these two, drag them over into my resource pack window over here. Boom, that's done it. Now, they won't automatically appear on the left-hand side. No, 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 that would be too simple. I'm gonna press done and done and back to game wibble about for a bit press escape go back to options resource packs and there we should see our uh, there's elements over here so if i just press right click on there uh i press done now let's see what what changes this has made Ooh. django's just joined me are you here Ooh, that's a nice. oh that looks amazing doesn't it so i think i'm gonna use that one <laughs> it looks great so let's go press done and back to game and see what wow it's pretty amazing so that's oh my goodness Let, let's go squids into look horrible. squids look at the sun sun's nice yeah okay squids look horrible let's look at these chickens oh wow they look a bit weird don't they squids are horrible so squids look horrible these flowers look pretty so that is a higher resolution pack oh weird let's press escape oh man look at all this stuff look at the look at the swords oh look at the pumpkins let's grab a pumpkin the swords. Oh, I haven't got mine. Let's uh, have a look at this. There we go. Put the pumpkin down. Ooh, spooky. Put one on your head. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What a great idea. Because you actually. I put one on my um, head. Whoa, cool. You need to actually. Oh, cool. 
Uh, it's they haven't changed the thing. Sometimes if you put a um, the reticules changed if you like, uh, that looks pretty different. That's pretty good. So that's uh, let's uh, let's get that off my head actually now. Take the pumpkin off my head. Okay, cool. So that's that texture pack which looks amazing. Okay, yeah, pretty good. So that's me changing the uh, the look and feel. Even the particles have changed. Look at that. Amazing. Squids are a bit creepy. Okay, let's find out the other one. Uh, so I press escape, remember, Op down to options, down to resource packs. Now I want to get rid of this. So you see that triangle there? I'm going to click on the triangle and send it back over to the right hand side. And I'm going to grab, grab modern HD, click on the triangle, and shoot that over to the right hand side and press done. And as I press done, what happens is Minecraft loads up that resource pack. Okay. Now this looks very smart and swish. Press done. Back well, to game. Modern. Okay, now well, that's pretty nice. The grass has changed definitely. The trees, they look pretty swish as well. Look at the leaves look on there. Look at the pumpkin. Look, look at the, the wood. The wood looks great. Very See? smart. I think it looks very clean, doesn't it? Have a look at the chickens. Chickens don't seem to have changed much. But look at this. Goodness me. Look at the sword, look at the sword. Sword, sword. I'm going to use that. Okay. I'm, I'm Diamond sword here. Obviously, they said the pack wasn't completed, and there is um, there are some... Look, there's original bow. What's this? It's a leather cap, which is like shades. Let's just try these on. Um, go in here. Okay, cool. Let's see what I look like with shades on. Hey, oh. I look pretty cool. I've got perfect shades on anyway, so it doesn't really affect me. So there you go. That's how you change texture packs, and that's how you download things from the internet. And I, you know, it's uh, you can get sent to some strange old places, especially if you do just do a Google search for texture packs. You can get, uh, you know, people trying to download viruses and all sorts of stuff. Try Planet Minecraft. It's one of the safest places I know uh, of getting kind of really good quality content. And of course, there's also the Minecraft forums as well. So that's a quick and easy tutorial about downloading resource packs. And remember, resource packs aren't just the look and feel of Minecraft. They can also include sounds and also 3D items. I wonder if there's any 3D items in here. Probably not. Oh, look, the jukebox looks amazing, though. Look at this. Um, look at that jukebox. That looks really really cool so you can do all sorts of things and just you know if you think you've been bored with minecraft you can just uh, use a resource pack and freshen it up and it's like playing a whole new game so i hope you've enjoyed this episode if you have any questions uh, and uh, and ideas do leave them in the comments below i do love hearing about what people have done with this stuff if you've got a resource pack as well for yourself uh, why don't you put it onto planet minecraft and then send us a link in the comments too Thank you very much for listening and watching and we we'll hope to uh, have some more 101 ideas for Minecraft learners out very very shortly. Until then, thank you and goodbye.